Um, I'm Leah and I think we need to just assess and, a, and assess the situation. I don't know about everyone else, but whenever anyone does their first video, it is so cringy. I think once we've got that out of the way, it gets a bit better. Now we've, um, you know, assessed the point that it's really cringy, I think we can move on to the actual video. So I'm gonna be showing a mixture of me going away to Boston for my 21st, which I'm really excited about. And a lot of people ask me like, what do I eat when I'm away as a vegan or like traveling? So I'm gonna show that. And also what I eat on my 21st birthday when I'm away in Boston, which I'm really excited about. So stay along and watch the video to find out. Right, now I need to go off to Whole Foods. So I'm back from Whole Foods and I went to a few other places. So I'll start with what I got at Whole Foods. Um, I got some stuff for their plane ride and also just like snacky stuff and also things I thought looked quite cool. So I've got a whole array of proper corn because they're always good to travel with. Then I picked up these Luke Organics Kel multigrain chips, they're really good. Then these hippies, which I love. Love corn, which are little like corn chips. And then I got these pea puffs, which are new. Um, and then Emily Crisp, which are a mixture of like French beans, sugar snap, pea crisp things. Um, and then I also picked up two of Olivia's Kitchen nuggets, which are so good. Um, delicious yellow balls, a few of them. And then I picked up a Lara bar. Um, a rude health and then I also had one this isn't from Whole Foods but I still had it over from my show favorite guys to zero shout out go have a look at them and then I got a whole array of naked bars I got a nush cream cheese almond milk sweet chili is the best flavor so good then I picked up this new pip and nut cherry bakewell which was really good and the ingredients are pretty good too so give that a try looks good and then also at whole foods i picked up yellow lentil um, lasagna sheets something different and also they're doing this new um, red lentil organic spaghetti so i'll give that a try be quite good for the plain journeys to make meals um, i picked up a tofu also a butternut squash to chop up um, apples are really good to travel with and then I went to Aldi and I picked up this almond butter which is super cheap super cheap so if you're looking for almond butter go to Aldi um, these peanut and chocolate chip cocoa brownies um, and then where are the ingredients ingredients aren't too bad not too bad um, and then these bars as well, which are all vegan. And then they also did these lentil bites, which I thought I was quite intrigued to try. Um, which have good ingredients as well. So I'll show you what I take and what I use, and I'll show you in a minute. I've also prepared some meals for the flight and traveling. So my boyfriend has the Vera meat and a fry sausage. Then I roasted some butternut squash and cinnamon. Um, some garden peas and some rice covered in mustard. Then I have the same, I've got butternut squash, roast and cinnamon, garden peas and tofu. Then we've got some apples, just garlic apples, some bananas, some grapes, which are my favorite. Then I've made um, my boyfriend James a uh, bagel with fried tofu with black salt. If you haven't tried it, it gives it a really eggy taste, which is really good. Um, and I use the Nush sweet chili in it as well, which is really, really good. And then another, meal I've got planned is I'm going to take this new zest wild strawberry protein 
with me and some oats and I'm just gonna ask when I go in if they can just fill up um, with some hot water and have some porridge. Um, and also, also look how cute this grape is I found. It looks like a bum or a heart. What do you think? Bum or heart? Pretty darn cute. 